Namaste and welcome. Today we'll be talking about Gemini, which is the third zodiac sign out of the 12 zodiac signs that we have. Now, Gemini are the people who are ruled by the planet Mercury. So they are people who are witty, uh, intelligent, in witty. They they can take bold steps when it comes to uh, taking about uh, talking about their career or decisions in life. They have very good sense of humor in the sense that they can have like double meaning words. They can speak sentences which will mean one thing, but uh, it can mean something else to somebody else. So you have to be a little intelligent to understand their sense of humor Though they are sort of intelligent kind of people, but they are inconsistent in their decision-making so they can be running They can be changing their careers quite often or running in multiple directions and still be uh, You know thinking about what can I do better in that situation? How can I apply my brains better? So it's all about using the mind mostly uh, That's the nature of this zodiac sign. It's like a dual Rashi or dual zodiac sign so they can behave like a male in certain situations and they can also behave like a female in, in different situations so they have this duality within them in terms of the way the mind works they make very good friends and partners with uh, libra sign seventh zodiac sign or aquarius the eleventh zodiac sign uh, they will find these two zodiac sign in order and of course the gemini themselves as good partners people to talk to or even relationships for that matter these are daytime zodiac signs, so which are like these people are very active during daytime and at night they will usually try to sleep in time, go to bed and get up in time kind of thing. They're very good fit for professions that involve consulting, IT, uh, just, just talking, right? Where, wherever the talking part is involved or you have to make decisions, basis, calculations, maths, accounts, journalism uh, sort of thing. Social media, media, communications, teaching in schools, be it a teacher or even learning a lot at the same time they can be very good fit for those kind of professions like an air sign so they will be communicating a lot uh, they would like to get some attention for their thoughts and uh, the mind is like it requires it's like a food so the, uh, the mind has to work again and again and again and taking different and different and different decisions so uh, they will not get a kick if they don't use their mind in every each and every situation so they are that is why they are intellectual uh, they are thought provoking people and they are the one who if somebody goes to a stage they can randomly talk about things that they don't even have thought of in the past so they are very good stage performers as well a sagittarius sign for instance is something which is totally against gemini people so they will have they will not find any solace or friendship with a sagittarius kind of which is the ninth zodiac sign in other words so I hope I covered the kind of traits Gemini have, kind of professions that are ideally suited for them, kind of partners they can expect and what in general they look like. Thanks for watching. Namaste.